Well, for the third time in the last month, Metro Police are investigating an officer-involved shooting, this time in Summerlin. So here's where it happened, in a gated community not too far from Alta and Pavilion Center. It happened shortly before 9 o'clock this morning. 8 News Now reporter Karen Castro tells us exactly what happened. Residents are in shock after a police shooting in what they call a quiet and safe community. Had a little bit of a heart attack, you know, and the first thing I thought was shooting in the school. Valerie Gonzalez does not want to show her face on camera, but she says she panicked after getting word that there was police activity near her son's school. Palo Verde High School and Sig Rogich Middle School were placed on lockdown during part of the police shooting investigation. I called him immediately, you know, and I was like, hey, what's going on? Are you okay? You know, like, of course my heart dropped. Police say detectives were looking for a man wanted for violent crimes. They went to a home on Poplar Leaf Street and called for the man to surrender peacefully. They say he had other plans. At this time, the suspect exited the residence in a vehicle from his garage and he rammed detectives' vehicles multiple times in an attempt to escape. At this time, officers fired upon the suspect. The suspect was taken to UMC in critical condition. Officers were not hurt. I called some of the moms, you know, that I know from here, and they were, you know, also freaking out and worried and so I was like, everything's good. Apparently it's outside of the school, which is still kind of like by surprise because this is a very nice community. Metro will be releasing more information about the latest police shooting within the next three days. Karen Castro, 8 News Now.